Red Bull looked invincible. Two crushing victories, and Ferrari appeared washed up, a shadow of their former glory. Then, Melbourne happened. A shock 1-2 finish, and suddenly, the prancing horse is back in the game. Was this a stroke of luck? Or the first chapter in Ferrari's comeback story? Let's break down the Australian Grand Prix shake-up. Written off after years of disappointment, Ferrari faced a crossroads this winter. Sainz, battling personal setbacks and losing his seat and his appendix, was desperate to silence the doubters. Leclerc, frustrated by missed opportunities, saw a chance to finally fight for the title. Their SF24 was a gamble, a radical departure under new leadership. In qualifying, it showed promise. In the race, it roared to life. Sainz, relentless in pursuit of Verstappen, unleashed the car's true potential, his triumph all the sweeter after his recent struggles. Leclerc, strategically astute, fended off the charging McLarens, a masterclass in defensive driving. This wasn't just luck, it was a statement of Ferrari's unwavering determination. Red Bull, the titans of F1, stumbled in Melbourne. Verstappen, plagued by technical gremlins all weekend, was forced into a gut-wrenching retirement as his car spectacularly failed. Perez, his wing damaged in early battles, couldn't find the pace to challenge. It's a wake-up call for the team that once seemed untouchable, a reminder that even giants can falter. Are the cracks beginning to show in their dominance? McLaren isn't just fighting for scraps anymore. Lando Norris, ever the opportunist, snatched a well-deserved podium, a testament to his relentless drive. Piastri, cool under pressure, proved he's a rising star, earning respect even in defeat. With renewed investment and a rejuvenated spirit, McLaren is clawing their way back to the top. Could this be the year they finally break through and snag a race win? A true return to their glory days? It was a disaster down under for the Silver Arrows. Hamilton's car woes left him stranded, a frustrating echo of last season's struggles. Russell, pushing too hard, ended his race tangled with Alonso, another costly error. The once mighty Mercedes, is a shadow of its former self. With Russell's mistakes raising questions and internal tensions brewing, can they even salvage their 2024 campaign, or is their era of dominance truly over? The championship is blown wide open. Red Bull finally faces a worthy challenger, Mercedes is scrambling to find their footing, and McLaren smells blood in the water. Can Ferrari keep the pressure on? Will Red Bull strike back? Subscribe to keep up with the updates.